This is Fox 9 News at 5. Hi, everyone. Thank you for joining us. We are following some breaking news. A federal agent shot the subject of an investigation early this morning. It happened in the Falwell neighborhood of North Minneapolis. This happened in the area of DuPont and Dowling, and Fox 9's Mary McGuire has been live on the scene this afternoon. So, Mary, uh, what do we know so far? Well, Kelsey and Amy, this all started very early this morning, and at this hour, there are still investigators here on scene collecting evidence. We've seen agents with the FBI and deputies with the Hennepin County Sheriff's Office taking pictures, collecting evidence both inside and outside the home that's at the center of this investigation. Now, Fox 9 has learned the man killed in today's agent-involved shooting was 33-year-old Chu Fang Yang. Authorities were serving a state carjacking warrant, and the FBI was called in to assist because it was considered high risk. As that warrant was being served around 6 a.m., Yang barricaded himself inside of the home and was armed, according to authorities. After several hours, he emerged from that home and was fatally shot. We do know that another adult was hurt in this and was taken to the hospital and is expected to survive. Authorities tell us Yang live streamed much of this incident on social media. During the course of this incident, which went on for several hours, this person was on uh, social media uh, videotaping uh, what was happening from inside the residence live. Um, so that does exist. Um, and and uh, clearly, uh, even from his own uh, social media, this, this person was armed during this incident. Now, we are told that no Minneapolis police officers were involved in the shooting, but they did help block off the scene during the investigation. It's still unclear exactly what role Hennepin County deputies may have played in all of this. Now, going forward, the FBI's inspection division will handle this investigation. They are called in to handle use of force investigations that involve their agents. Reporting live tonight, Mary McGuire, Fox 9.